Yo. What is good chat? Hey, let me know if you're ready for the spoilers, man. If you're ready for the spoilers. Hold on, I don't even know. If you guys can... Uh... Hey man, we're going to be looking at the spoilers, man. We're going to be looking at the spoilers for 255 of Jujutsu Kaisen. You know how it be? Usually we be going over the spoilers, trying to make sure that we can cook and see how it goes. What's good, Zoom? Hope you're doing well. My mama girl is going to get cooked. <laughs> Hey, bro, first of all, W membership, you have a different color now. Mom, and yes, Miguel is going to def, yo, bro, apparently they've already kind of said from the get go that um, it's not going to be just Miguel fighting if you didn't know. But hey, man, shout out to Zoom, you're a real one, bro. I was just staying subbed and stuff. You already know I'll be streaming, man. It's just that... Uh, last week i didn't stream last week i just missed it last week but i've been quite consistent man i've been quite consistent um besides that besides that that little hiccup you know i wanted to see if i can add um something else on the screen as well let me see if i can add it real quick oh did that work did it work i think it did yes yes sir yes sir yes sir all right, cool. Uh, ignore this for now. All I'm doing is I'm going to reduce it. It's going to be like, because I can't lie, I've been playing a little Tekken recently, bro. So, obviously, I'm going to just keep on the side here. I'm going to turn off the sound of all the Tekken as well. So then after that, you know, we can actually navigate for, uh, um, we can actually navigate the, the real, the real, real, real thing we want to see. Yeah, but hey, Choso apparently is coming through as well. You're right. Apparently Choso, Choso's coming through. Hey, if Choso comes through, I can't lie. I haven't seen Choso box in a minute. I'm looking forward to Choso boxing. 100%. Uh, 150%. Uh, yeah, finally. Well, it's cool. Hmm... Uh, Master, yes, fam. Hey, guys, I'm telling you, these are gonna be serious, 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 serious spoilers, because we are going to be seeing a lot unfold. We're gonna be seeing a lot unfold, and you'll be able to see it first here. You know, um, obviously, we are just gonna be getting ready to witness and watch these spoilers. And I'm telling you guys right now, man, I'm hype as hell. And when I maybe I don't sound it, but I'm telling you guys for free, I am pumped. Cause I I want this I want this to happen, bro. Uh, let me just change the box real quick, cause I can't like that's that one be be make it looking clearer. Yeah. Hey, who else is excited for the spoilers today, man? Who was excited for the spoilers today? Who else is excited for the spoilers today? And also, um, if there's anything with my audio or anything like that, let me know, okay? Uh, let me know if there's anything... Uh, oh, fine. Okay, hold on. It's sorted, it's sorted. Hold on. Uh, yes, uh, I must say me. Choso, come on. Hey. Bro, I'm excited as well, man. Not just you, bro. I'm excited as well. I'm going to be looking uh, through it. Man said, Jordan Tucker. What's good, my boy? Hey, welcome to the stream. Yeah, man, I'm ready. I'm letting you know for free. I am ready. I am ready for these spoilers. We are here. Anything that happens, anything that's about to go on, we will see. Uh, let me actually turn off this because we don't need it technically then in it hold on oh my days
Uh, yeah, that's better. Cool. Now, yeah, so here we're just waiting for the spoiler. Nicholas King, you know, the time is near. Facts, the time is 100% near. Is 150% near, bro. And when we do get to see those spoilers, we're going to be eating. Telling you for free. For free, we're going to be eating. Hey, man, I can't wait. I can't wait. Oh, hold on. Let me um. Let's do. Let's do a bit more. So it's like yeah. Okay. So guys, this is in the bottom right corner. You're probably wondering what what why is that on or anything like that. It just Tekken. While we wait, um, I'll just be playing and stuff like that. Man, like misery. It was good misery, bro. Wait, misery. You know, boo. Tekken has cold music. <laughs> Tekken has cold music, bro. You know, boo. Uh, do you remember Mega Me adapting to Unlimited Void? Nah, he didn't. Mega Me didn't adapt to the Unlimited Void, bro. Mega Me specifically did not adapt to the Unlimited Void. I don't know where you got that from. That did not happen. But what I am waiting for, man, I'm waiting for those spoilers. Die. Ooh. I am waiting for those spoilers. Um, do you think merger will the final boss of JJK? Hey, bro, I think the merger is about to be <laughs> one of the one of the final bosses. But I don't know if the plan will go through when it comes to Tengen. I don't know. I don't know because would they allow them to do such a thing especially with how you know maharaga is going to um not maharaga what am i talking about especially with when it comes to the tengen itself there's no way that they'll allow civilization or humans to be actually <laughs> look at shibuya actually it's very possible it's actually very possible let me let me be, let me calm down it's actually very possible bro very very possible and also um misery i'm not gonna stay up uh, for tonight but gonna drop in tonight and just say hi hey what's good hey. Hey, hey, hey yeah that's my guy bro misery my guy zoom said um jjk get repetitive his new character shows up sukuno lose to Sukuno. uh lose to sukuna turns out sukuna's holding back nah i think um this week will be a bit different man i'm not gonna lie because even from the original part of it even from the original part of it bro there's no, there's just no way that can be the case. You know what I'm saying? There's just no way that can be the case to happen again. I generally think right now is going to be a situation where all of them are fighting them at once. And we haven't had that happen. So, hey, for the stream, I'm going to put Gojo, bro. If you look on the bottom right, you'll see that I'm playing with Gojo. Hold on, let it load up. Jeez, look at Gojo. Satoru. <laughs> I made my character look like Gojo in the game. And we're going to play some, the closest thing to Sukuna. The devil. Sheesh. Um, yeah, I know. That's the first thing Sukuna adapted to. Uh, Sukuna adapted to was Unlimited Void, the essence of the six eyes. Meaning Megami is the next host without being born to have it. I don't know if that would be the case, man. I don't know if that would be the case, bro. Kenny is the skull that Sukuna ate. So Tengen... How can Kenny be the skull? It's because the skull, if anything, was reminded to us as Sukuna himself. So I don't think that's possible. But maybe you're onto something. That I don't know. Um, when does the leaks come out? The leaks are going to come out maybe in the next like 10, 20 minutes. Um, according to the way that they're doing it, they're just translating it right now, uh, from the looks of it. Uh, streaming at 3am is crazy, bro. Hey, this is what I do, man. When the spoilers are about to come out, I'm always there for my people. 
My people want to see spoilers. I say I'll give them spoilers, you know. <laughs> they always want to see the spoilers and chat, chat in the chat and stuff like that. So I'm always happy to do that. 100%. I'm always happy to do that. Always, always happy. Um, so hey, if you are part of the eleven viewers that are in the stream right now, maybe it might be more, maybe it might be less. Make sure you make uh, leave a like on the stream. Usually, that's what we tend to do when it comes to these spoilers. Uh, subscribe if you're new as well. It would be appreciated. And yeah, man, hey, we're gonna be gassed when we read these chapters. I can feel it already. If you guys remember when Sukuna did the Black Flash, I was hype, bro. I was so hype. I couldn't even contain it. <laughs> not one bit and it went crazy so yeah man i'm hoping something gas happens again like that um and if something gas happens again like that then bro you guys are going to be in for another reaction man okay so it says yuji choso maki and miguel all together assemble to fight sukuna this is what they're saying at the moment this is why the titles of Avenger sorcerers assemble uh yuji is going to play ping pong with sukuna's Vifuga. how would that even be possible <laughs> I don't think Sukuna is, is 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 I don't think Yuji's playing with anything, bro. Yuji would be lucky to get away alive. Sukuna didn't adapt to a limited void though. He used my rugged adaptation to Infinity as a tutorial on how to develop the slash that cuts through space itself. Yes, this is what happened. Um, it wasn't Megami, which is what someone said earlier before. But um, Sukuna also didn't adapt to the Infinite Void. Because that's that like, that's just not his bag, man. You know what I'm saying? Let's see if I can actually play. Oh my PC's cooked. Oh, looking kinda cooked. Sheesh. Oh. Let's learn some stuff, man. Uh Utah blood, not UG. It's a Utah. Oh, Utah, my bad, my bad, my bad. But even then, you think Utah's gonna body Sukuna like that? I don't I don't think so, man. I don't think so. Hakari the going MG to be frozen and his heart replaced Sukuna's for into Yo, Jordan Tucker, you got the craziest theories, bro. You got the craziest theories. Yo. It's it's not it's not it's not it's interesting for sure. It's interesting for sure, man. I can't lie. You got crazy theories, though. Not that they're bad. I'm saying in terms of like, these are some I've never heard before. Yeah, they're about to jump Sukuna, man. They're about to jump for Sukuna for sure. Man said, Upi, uh, five nine, so, uh, pre leaks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is that pre leaks? As soon as the leaks come on, hey, we're locking in. Hmm, I forgot what I was meant to do there. Oh yeah, I know what to do. Oh wait, no. It's like, uh, uh, uh. Mm, mm, mm. Hold on. Um, yeah, we're still waiting for the leaks. The leaks are coming soon. The leaks are coming very, very soon. Um, let me uh shout the stream on my Twitch real quick, actually. Give me a second. Just so that we know how we're gonna move, man. We know how we're gonna move. So live uh, home. Damn, it's not showing I'm streaming. I'm just gonna plug the stream real quick, guys. I'm gonna plug the stream. As I said, when the spoilers start kicking in, man, we're gonna really have a good discussion, and we're gonna be able to analyze what is going on within the chapter without any fail. And as I said, if you are new here, make sure you leave a like on the stream, subscribe if you are new, and I'll be happy. I'm telling you again. I'd be happy to have you to the family. Uh, the GX Yakuza. Um, I said, what you talking about? <laughs> hey, Nicholas Kim said, what are you talking about? Um, let's see. And Yuta ate his fingers, so he needs to gain his original technique that he couldn't use because of Yuta eating the finger first. You know what? Yeah, hold on. Actually, let me, let me actually read it because... You might, hey, Jordan Tucker might be cooking the theory of theories, bro. 
Hold on, Hakari the Goe MG to be frozen and his heart would replace Sukuna's for infinite cut energy to start the merger. That that one's a bit crazy. Hey, Hakari ain't dying. Hakari ain't going out that side, bro. Hakari is not going out that side. And Yuta ate his fingers, so he needs to gain his original technique that he couldn't use because of Yuta eating a finger first before Yuji. Mm, so you're saying Sukuna's prevented from like getting to his original, you know what I'm saying, um, technique just because he doesn't have the extra finger that, you know, belongs to him, of course. Okay, uh, that's why Yuji will not let Sukuna's technique uh, because it was given to Yuta already. With Sky Manipulation, he will do a 180 rotation and give Sukuna that fuga back. <laughs> what? Hey, Zach Zachria, that will be fire. If if you talk to the sky manipulation and he, and Sukuna hits the you know the fuga, and then he just hits it back at him, that will be cold. What? Minus one, five, four, two. Nine. Okay. I want to learn the. Oh, it's like this. I need to learn that. Um, would make him bleed. I don't think Yuji is getting cleaved this mantle though, to be honest. Uh, even if he does, it wouldn't matter because he can't use two Kastenika at the same time. Ah, uh, yeah, he is using blood manipulation though, to be fair. He is using blood manipulation. I don't know if it will make him useless, but I get exactly what you mean though. So that's fine. Damn. Oh, I need to chase up better. You gotta remember, Yuji isn't a normal sorcerer, though, so it's possible. Yeah, no, exactly. It's very possible. It's not not impossible at all. Not impossible at all. But do you think they're gonna give Yuji more stuff now? I feel like he got a, a new stuff already. But like, for me, I'm not that impressed with them. Of course, the new stuff he's got. I mean, blood manipulation. I wanted him to get something new, unique to himself. And obviously he has the soul punches, but that's similar to what he did against Maito, so he's not that much different, you know. The only thing difference is that he can specify where he wants to hit and stuff like that. So that's the only, only difference, really. Um, that shit will be unique and look fire. Uh, I mean, a domain expansion blood blood manipulation would definitely be unique. I agree with that 100%, I can't lie. In fact, it would be one of the most unique in the show, to be honest, man. If I'm being real. If I'm being very, very, very honest. Uh, hold on, let me actually add something to... Uh... Oh, hold on. Let me see if there's any any update right now. Let's see, you guys, if there's any update. They say gather over here quick. Okay, that seems like the beginning of what's happening. Ooh, okay, guys, we got our first, first chap, like first page. We have gotten our first page. Look at this, guys. All right, lock in, lock in, lock in. Miguel joins. Okay, you see, Miguel joins in, bro. And he, oh, so you use there, and then Lor Loru. If you guys know who this is, this is the person that um, this this is the the person that Yuki used to teleport with, and the person that Ghetto actually was part of you know the the people that invaded the jujutsu high like at the time 
if you guys remember what I'm talking about all. This like this is not Loru, that is L A R U E. I don't know how to pronounce it, but that's the, that that is the one, bro. That is the one. So that I think that's why maybe Oh, and you can see like a big hand that's carrying um Kusakabe, which means that is potentially part of the curse technique since they're folding their arms. Like that is the curse technique, man. Pretty impressive, if you ask me. Miguel with Ghetto's uh, group? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Ghetto's part of Ghetto's group as well. So, the Ghetto group members are coming back. Which is so funny because once upon a time, they tried to kill them and stop them. like Or, you know, not kill them to actually kill them because obviously they like the sorcerers. But they really tried to help. They really, really, really tried to help. This is the first panel, guys. If anyone's new here, this is the first panel um, where Miguel joins the fight. And we see Loru, okay, Loru being able to grab Kusakabe with their curse technique hand. And they saved Yu Yu in the process. A top tier like Miguel? Nah, that guy has aura. Yeah, facts. Facts. They have aura right now. 15 to 20 minutes. Damn. Yeah, man, we're looking at the the raw picks right now man but it seems like my mirror shouted that out right now uh do you think it'll come, it'll come back ah do you think todo will come back i don't think it'll come back because if it was if todo was going to come back they would have brought it back sooner rather than later you know what i'm saying they would have brought it back sooner rather than later because why would you postpone it that long if you were to come back, of course. So, guys, this is the first panel that we get. I know there's a lot of new people here. This is the first panel that we see when it comes to Miguel, uh, Yu Yu, and L Loru. Okay? And this panel is basically showing how Ghetto's members, Ghetto's people, came through in the clutch and protected Yu Yu from dying. You know, if Yu Yu de died, all, everyone would be finished. This guy is the king of teleportation and the person that is the reason why they are where they are now. Literally the reason why they are where they are. So without, without Yu Yu, hey, this will be a cook sesh. Higuruma, Utah, they're all in the back. I don't know if Higuruma is fully, fully dead because, you know, they protected the body. But they're in the back right now cooking. So potentially something crazy can happen. Something crazy can happen, 100%. Um, so, Swagmaster, welcome to the stream. You said, wait, is Kusakabe alive? It doesn't look like Kusakabe is dead yet. Like, Kusakabe is injured, and you can see the eyes... Uh, yeah, you can see Kusakabe's eyes open. So, Kusakabe is not fully dead yet, guys. Obviously, as you know, when he uses his um, domain, he's able to nullify the effects of the slash. Which obviously show is shown here, you know? So that's why he's still alive. Thankfully. So that guy saved you. Um if so, all Miguel speed feeds get crushed? No 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 no. Um I th I think um Miguel saved Yuyu, but Loru is taking Kusakabe away. Or saved took Kusakabe away from Sukuna, something along those lines, you know? Um, Heavenly RJ, what's what's up, man? Welcome to the stream. I appreciate you for coming through. All right, guys, we're gonna see page two now. Ooh, today we're seeing some Miguel action. We're seeing some top tier Miguel action. So Miguel's having a flashback. Oh no! Ah, oh, every time we see someone with a flashback, nothing good happens. Oh my gosh, bro. Look, look at everyone in the comments already saying that he's dead. I don't know if you guys can see that. Yeah, look, the comments. People say, look, he's bald. Okay, he's bald. <laughs> These guys are funny, man. Um, Oh, no. Ha like, bro, flashbacks. Every time there's a flashback, something wrong happens. Oh, my gosh. And by the way, guys, if you are new here, make sure you leave a like and subscribe. It'd be much appreciated. But, yeah, I'm not going to lie to you. 
Miguel doing the flashback is over. Miguel's gonna meet his maker. Billy B, I'm looking on Twitter, bro. I'm on Twitter. Bro looks clean though, damn. Yeah, he looks clean, bro. But damn, I, I thought he had a little bit of hair. That's <laughs> that's kinda tough. That is kinda tough. Do you think he will actually fight this chapter? Yeah, yeah, hundred percent. Bro, this, there's no time to like chill. Like he has to fight. There's no there's no chance. Nah, the comments are hella funny. D man are saying, what? He's bold. Drake? He's bold? No way. <laughs> hey man. He's pulling he's pulling off the bold look though, guys. You can't lie. Hey, Miguel kinda look he kinda look clean even though he's bold. He got like a hammerhead, but other than that, like. You know how you could say Michael, Michael Jordan, like, hey, I would have given Miguel the craziest Michael Jordan, bro. I would have gave Miguel the craziest Michael Jordan. The slap in the back of the head. <laughs> I'm actually finished, bro. But, hey, it seems that Ghetto's people actually t turn up. Who would have thought that Ghetto's people would save the Jujutsu sorcerers, bro? That is just that. The irony in that is crazy. The irony in that alone. Is actually crazy, bro. He said, Oh no. Um, if my theory is correct about the stuff being Kenny, now Sukuna has all the memories to fight them. Oh, oh. Miguel with the W. Uh wait, is Kusakabe alive? Um, yeah, yeah, my bad. So I'm seeing old things. I'm seeing old things, my bad, my bad. Uh, do you read comics? No, I don't read comics, but I should be. Hey, DTV, by the way, I've I seen you. Hey, what's up, bro? I hope you're doing well. Um, the ones they use for predictions. Oh, okay. So you're saying that's a that's a crystal orb. By the way, guys, there's another chapter. Damn, that's a... Yo, that is a lengthy... Hey, we need some text. All of these people just linking up, chatting in Africa. God damn. Yo, that is hefty, eh? We need some we need some translations right here. I just saw Choso panel. Wait, Choso Kamo, I'm happy you saw a Choso panel. I don't know where you saw it. Hopefully it's not a fake one, because there's a lot of fake ones that are going around recently. But W. Hey man, look, there's, there's still a couple pages to see, bro. There is still a couple of pages to see. Right now we've got Utah in Africa just chilling with the people them. Hey, shout out to Utah, man. Shout out to Utah in Africa, bro. So, at this very moment, uh, you said it's not. It's not fake. Okay, that's good. Choso come on, man. I'm happy to hear that. Hopefully, we get to see it here as well. That's obviously what we're looking forward to. You know, we're looking forward to seeing that. Uh, doing great. Cheers, man. How you doing? Yeah, I'm good, DTV, bro. I'm doing well. All right, guys. We're about to see the next panel, the next page. All right. These are all without translations. So in 15 to 20 minutes, we'll be having the translations. Miguel thoughts and chat with a guy. What do you mean with a guy? Yo, this guy doesn't know who Laru is. No, fair enough though. Like some people don't know it. Even when I was rereading it, I didn't really know. Whoa, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, Swagmaster, don't don't spoil it, don't spoil it. I know we're, <laughs> the irony because we're, we're looking at spoilers, but we'll get it. We'll get there. We will get there. We will get there. We will get there. All right, all right. Hold your excitement. Swagmaster, hold your excitement. And then when we see it, we'll be all, like, hyped together, you know? Uh, the guy looks like Gojo with white hair. Nah, man, he doesn't look like Gojo. This is LaRue. My bad. No, no, no problem, Swagmaster, man. No problem. Wow. Look, guys, by the way, in the bottom right corner, I'm playing, obviously, Tekken. But <laughs> you see I have the Gojo fit. I have the black. I have the, the joggers. I've got the white hair. Hey, bro. I'm repping Gojo in this in this game, bro. Repping Gojo for real. Look, that was red. <laughs> that is red. Sheesh. Reverse Katani red. <laughs> anyway, um, 
Now we're waiting for the next chapter of I mean, the next page. And in the meantime, let me ask you guys a question. Do you think that what do you think you to learn the most when he was in Africa? I'm actually very interested to think what you guys uh, believe about that because I hear Utah went to Africa, he trained and stuff like that. But what do you think he actually learned? Well, hold on. There's another. There's another page, guys. Okay, from the looks of it, it seems like it's more of the same. Obviously, people are gonna say it's a boring chapter and stuff like that, but. It can't be boring. There needs to be some, some calm down time. You know what I'm saying? He needs to be lays out his plan to the guy. Bro, it's, it's Larry, but fair enough, isn't it? But wait, Miguel has a full set plan. Like he knows what he wants to do or what they're gonna do. So let me see what you guys, some of your answers were. I know some of your answers are kind of interesting. Um, hand to hand combat. He definitely learned his d domain expansion in Africa. That there, uh, yeah, maybe you know what, Swagmaster, that's not bad. That he might have actually learned in Africa. Um, Prodigal says that there are black people in the world. <sighs> hey, you're a funny guy, bro. <laughs> you're a funny guy. Hey, I hear it. Hey, he did. Hey, at least he learned something. You know what I'm saying? He did learn that, that the black people exist. But I think he knew that even from. Uh, the ghetto times, even from the year before, like he 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 he, he knew that. All right, guys. So the next panel coming through, we see, okay, we see, Loru, Miguel is ready to fight with Sukuna, so Sukuna with someone. Damn, this guy don't know who someone is. He just keeps <laughs> keeps calling them someone. I'm actually laughing. <laughs> yeah, look, someone in the comments was like, quit saying someone. That is hilarious. But it looked like they're about to start fighting, man. They have their plans set out on how they're going to do it. Oh, sorry about that. Sorry, my mic was kind of... Damn. Damn, my bad, my bad. So, I think he learned more about cursed tools and other cultures along with us usual combat training. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And maybe he just increased his knowledge of Jujutsu in general, you know? How the F uh, was he a vessel? Was who a vessel? Oh, you're talking about um, Jordan Tucker's theories. I just don't see Miguel uh, teach Utah. We never saw him use a curse technique. No, 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 no. But at the end of the day, Miguel was very skilled. I think even Gojo raided him. That's why Gojo let Miguel teach him. In the first place, Gojo rated Miguel highly. Especially since Miguel was able to survive against Gojo, bro. We have to really realize what that feat is. Not a lot of people can get punched by Gojo and survive another day, but hey, that black rope be working. That it be putting it. <laughs> it be working, bro. Hmm. Okay. Now let's see. Now the guy said the shirtless guy. Yo, this yo, this guy is hilarious, bro. The guy posting the, the stuff is hilarious. Alright guys, so from the first thing that happens is Laru attacks first with his move, projects his hand uh big and grabs a kuno. So right now it seems like a tag team battle, so they're jumping. You know what I'm saying? Because, <laughs> guys, do you know how funny it is that Jujutsu Kaisen, no matter what, no matter what country you're from, they're always going to be jumping. There's always going to be some jumping, bro. Uh, man's learned about voodoo. Yeah, that's facts. Uh, Miguel himself wasn't actively trying to fight Gojo. He was just trying to hold him back to buy time. Yeah, exactly. So we really don't know what his attacking capabilities is. Maybe his attack capability is crazy, but I mean, if Gojo was something that he was just trying to buy time about or time from, then what the hell is he going to do to, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? What the hell is he going to do to Sukuna? I can't really see what he could do to Sukuna, given the circumstance, given the current circumstance. Jump Kaizen has begun. Yeah, finally. 
we'll finally see some action but i'm interested to see the new type of like techniques and stuff like that that these people have in store because i, w I really want to know i want to know like you know what i'm saying what are some of the techniques That's 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 peak. That's what I'm, I I want to know. Okay. So da da da. Um. So hey man, I think Sakuna. If we're being like 100% real. Sukuna is just going to let them do what they want. If we're being real, man. And the reason I'm saying that is because all the time Sukuna lets them do what they want. So you can see what they're about. If they can test him, if they can push him further. And then he destroys them. But the Laru thing is interesting though. I never knew someone that could uh, extend their body in such a way. A cursed energy formed hand, do you think? Oh yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah, you're right. You're right, you're right, you're right. You might be right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think you're right still. Yeah, 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 yeah. You're right, you're right, you're right. Tucker, Tucker knows bull. This is like a cursed energy type of hand. I wonder what specifically it can do. Like, I wonder what the actual purpose of it is, like, purely. Bro, why can I not land that? No way I need the wall. Uh, Devil May Cry Tashi. <laughs> Master Devil May Cry Tashi. Um, you got Devil Trigger. Look, I don't think my girl's goal is to kill Sukuna. You think it's to stall him? Hey, maybe, maybe it's to stall him as well. But we don't know the plan. I think they discussed it, but obviously we didn't get to get the translation, so we really don't know. Well, the next page has dropped, guys. So let me just go to the next page so we can see. So we can really see what's going on. Unknown guy's hand attack crushes the building, but Sukuna evades. Yeah, that's... Wow. That's, that looks like a lot of damage, to be fair. But Sukuna evading was always to be expected, man. Always to be expected. But something tells me Miguel... Miguel is about to attack now himself. It looked like Sukuna was about to boom La Laru. Hey, man. From time Sukuna dodged it that easily. Yeah. Yeah, I think it might be... It might be grits for, my, for him, man. It might be grits for him. My gosh. Yeah. I think Miguel might be insanely fast. Like, I'm not gonna lie, I feel like Miguel is rapid. Miguel actually might be so rapid and we just like been underestimating him because of the way he got bullied by Gojo. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Okay, let's see what happens. So right now we see. Uh, 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 let's just refresh it. Miguel Lola is not as well. Do you know what makes me laugh? Hey, Ahmad yeah, was like, bro, it's good. Miguel looks like he's not touched though. Next panel, Miguel is getting touched. He got hit with a barrage. Of dismantles. A barrage. Wait. Is he dodging them? Hold on. Hold on. Miguel might be cooking. Is he dodging them? There's no damage. No way he's dodging slashes like this. What? <laughs> wait, wait. So wait, it might not be a joke. He might be the strongest sorcerer. Nah. No way this guy is dodging these dismantles, bro. Nah. This <laughs> Yo. No, dodging is insane. 
<laughs> weaving, weave. Hey, you know what it is though? It's the black people gene, bro. The black people gene allows you to weave. You can weave anything. Weave, weave, like the quick. It's part of the genes. No, I don't. <laughs> hey, Miguel's the goat. What the hell? Miguel is the goal. We done new. Hey Willis, you yeah, you're ahead of the curve. You was ahead of the curve then. Hey, I thought I knew Miguel was gonna cook. But I didn't think he's gonna dodge this mantles like like it's like it's a playtime thing, bro. Look, he's just dodging. He got that tribe buff. <laughs> tribe buff is insane. Tribe buff is insane. Chasing them lines that Africa be paying off. Hey, you better. You guys are wilding, bro. You guys are wilding. Oh, what did he throw out? Miguel throws hands on Sukuna with unknown guy. Uh, grabbed by a hand in the backdrop. Man said they're exchanging hands. Ooh, look at Miguel exchanging hands, yo. Nah, I never knew Miguel would be this gas. Nah, I can't lie. Miguel fighting is hilarious, bro. Like, Miguel fighting is hilarious. But I don't know how much... Like, LaRue literally got sent to Abyss. Like, he used his hand to even help himself escape. Because right now, this is a battle between <laughs> Miguel and Sukuna, bro. Maybe he is the real honored one that we didn't know. Yeah, he got swag with it as well, bro. Hey, man, Hakari, man. Hey, I fought Hakari, but I found out he ain't, he ain't black. I don't know what happened, bro. That's what everyone thought he was gonna be. Kind of, kind of scammed us, but it's alright. It's alright. It's alright. You have swag fight, is you know, obviously. Yeah, bro. I mean, hope this is gonna be swag before he dies, probably, man. Let's be real. Like Sukuna ain't losing, so what's gonna what's gonna really happen? What's gonna really happen, you feel me? Like, 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 what is really gonna happen? Miguel, top 10 strongest agenda, gonna go crazy in, trick, in Twitter? Bro, Miguel might get the buff of a lifetime in the top 10s. People are gonna start saying Miguel's top 10, bro. He's dodging dismantles. Mackie was barely, barely dodging dismantles, bro. But this guy did the barrage and literally dodged all of them. Like, that is crazy, bro. Yeah, man. I hope Hakari is, 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 is doing that. Real talk. I hope Hakari is doing that. That's the only thing I accept. Uh... Um, who's your favorite JJK girl? My Yuki. Oh, I think it might be Maki, man. I know that sounds kind of like like typical, but it's like Maki is the, Maki's her, bro. Maki is her. Let's be real, man. Maki is her. Let me uh check now. It was Nobara, but Nobara, you you know I picked up Nobara. So then I just started gravitating towards Maki more. Um. So oh, okay. Wait, hold on. Gojova got the you got the translations now. Okay, guys, so this is the question now, yeah? Do you want us to go through the translations that Mayamura has put up? Or do you want us to go through um, the rules, the raw scans? Or do you want to read it with the translations? Let me know what you guys want. Because at the end of the day, we want to like enjoy it together, right? So I could go through the translations as well. Uh, you said both, any I don't mind. Full translations, raw scans. Okay, so some people want more scans, some people want Maya translations. Okay, 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 okay. We're gonna we're gonna handle this. Oh, rules first. Okay, so you guys say F it, we don't care. Okay, yeah, 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 that's fine, that's fine. Yeah, I'll go I'll go through the I'll go through the rule. 
The reason I'm gonna go through the rules first is because we've seen half of it. The beginning part is boring, like translations and stuff like that. Now it's just foreign hands, which you don't really need, you know. You don't really need foreign hands translations to know they're foreign hands, you know what I'm saying? But we'll look at it at the same time. You will be on at the same time, guys. Name of Twitter account? Uh, my Twitter account? GXL, if that's what you're asking. Or unless you're talking about the other one. I'm not sure. Uh, when we recapping, uh, we can check translations. Yeah, yeah, Nicholas King, you're cooking. That's why you're mod, bro. You're cooking, you're cooking, you're cooking. So, uh, read it with... Uh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, my translation for last. Yeah, all right, bet, bet, bet. It seems like everyone wants to really see the scenes and stuff like that. So that we can analyze it afterwards. Oh, I can actually play from here. Hold on. Uh. Okay, so you da da da. Like, bro, I actually quite so. I'm seeing if there's like another a page or panel or anything like that. But I can't like the F9 guy hasn't really been cooking yet, man. Yeah, I hadn't been cooking yet. Hey, shout out to the... Yo, hold on. I didn't even know it's the 50 viewers. Hey, yo, what's up, man? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hey, guys, we're going through both the chapter translations. And we're going to be also be going through the rules at the same time. We know right now, Miguel is scrapping, bro. I'm actually so surprised that Miguel is holding up right now. I never thought Miguel was going to hold up this long. But he is proving the hate is wrong. And he's proving me wrong, too. I thought Miguel was going to be like, you know, using the black rope to stop, but he's actually boxing. So how much stronger did he get? I mean, to be honest, Gojo, as you said, Gojo's job was not to, the job wasn't to really stop. You know what I'm saying? It wasn't really to stop. So now he can actually like go all out. When against Gojo, he didn't go all out, you know? I'm telling you, Miguel's going to get put to the top tens. That is insane. Who would have thought Miguel would have ended up in the top 10 JJK strongest? That is so funny. Yo, bro. I'm telling you, the memes are going to be crazy. This week, the memes are going to go insane. I need Sukuna to grab someone with two arms and rip their arms with... The Damn! I'm odd. Why? That's gruesome as hell. Why? Why do you need that? Why do you... Why do you need that? Damn. Interesting. So, uh Okay, Mappa is listening. I'm not, yo, bro, if that happens, that would be a gruesome sight. It would look, it, it would look kind of comp. Don't get twisted. It would look kind of cool, but I'd be like, damn, where'd that come from? <laughs> like, I'd be like, damn, you, you didn't need to do anyone. Like, I don't think there's any character that deserves that. Like, any character that deserves to, like, get done dirty like that. Oh my god, since my mirror posted, like no one's posting anymore. What, what's going on? What is going on? No one's posting anymore now. Hey yo, shout out to the people that are in the stream, bro. There's a hell of people. Wow, my mirror said, hey yo, stop. Stop posting now. I'm, I'm here. Yo, that's that's I never knew that guy's working for my mirror now. That's kind of crazy. You know there used to be enemies. They take it forever. Yeah, yeah, they take it forever now, man. Can I gotta go to bed, man. <laughs> I, I got work in the morning. Low key. But wait, so the FX guy is not posting no more rules, bro. Anyway, guys, I'm just gonna read it for you. Flashback to Yuta discussing with Miguel and Lori. Uh, Miguel rejects Yuta's request to fight Sukuna, saying, Why does he have to fight a monster who has a possibility of winning against Gojo? 
Hey, that sounds like Miguel, bro. That sounds like something Miguel would... That look like something Miguel would say. He's like, bro, why would I waste my time? You got a job? I mean, I do... Yeah, man, kind, kind of, kind of not. Yeah, yeah, I basically kind of do, you know. It's only 12 p.m. here. Hey, bro, it's uh, 4 a.m. here, bro. You might be getting them in batch. Or preparing the big-ass drop of a panel. I mean, I think in batch might be the right answer. Or my mirror said, yeah, don't post no more. Let me just post it with the with the translations. Which, it sounds like my mirror, man. I'll be honest. I'll be so honest. 6 a.m.? Yeah, look, everyone's up at these crazy times. And I'm assuming I'm you haven't even slept. Like, everyone's up at these crazy times for the JJK spoilers, bro. This is when, what happens when you're dedicated to your craft, man. This is what happens when you have that JJK in you. This is what happens. Okay. This is what happens, guys. This is what happens. I mean, to be honest, hey, if everyone else on the ch in the chat right now, let me know what time it is where you are at. What time are you sacrificing? Or what time are you watching the stream, you know, for the JJK leaks? I want to see how many people actually, you know, <laughs> you know, exercise their flipping sleep. So then after that, they can uh, get some JJK leaks. Because I know there's a lot of people. Twelve AM for me, okay, okay. That's not too bad. Yeah. Twelve AM is like, uh, eh, we're about it could be bad, it could be worse, you know what I'm saying, it's in between. The only one five in the morning France hour. Oh hey, the only one France? France? Eh the France Hey bro. I I mess I mess with France proper. I hope I didn't mock <laughs> the language there, but I can't lie, like I fuck with I have a lot of uh, French friends from like uh, some competitive fighting game I used to play. Um, 12.13 in the Caribbean. Is it in the AM or the PM? I chose us at 5 AM. Look at look at everyone fucking it out. God damn. Look at everyone fucking it out in the late night. Or early morning. Everyone's fucking it out. Everyone's fucking it out. I don't talk much French I'm totally from another part of the world but currently oh okay 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 no that's completely fine bro that is completely fine I'm just waiting for another by the way guys they take quite a while now to release the leaks man but we're gonna get them oh no no just as I said that we've got another one lovely but I think FX is not posting no more I think it's just my mirror Lori tries to convince uh, Miguel saying I'm just asking you to help us deliver the final blow to the otherworldly being Sukuna, who will be burnt out after Gojo Miguel Chan. Oh, so Mc so Lo Lori Lori was always on job, like he was always going to, you know, um, help with the Gojo Sukuna situation. So, guys, by the way, just to let you know, if you really think about it. These guys were preparing that Gojo was going to lose from the get-go. Like, look how prepared they are that Gojo was going to lose. Like, are you not seeing this? They were prepared, man. They were prepared. Wait. I just realised. <laughs> I don't know why it took me to look at the chat to realise. They called him Miguel-chan. What the hell? I, I don't know if I'm tripping. Is it did that mean like they're close like like that? Is it that mean they're close like that? Like I forgot what chan specifically means. Is it like um 
like older, like your your elder, or what is it? Wait, prodigal. Your name your name is actually prodigal. The prodigal. Oh, that's kind of cold. Prodigal is a cool name. Obviously, Nicholas is cool as well. Prodigal though. Damn. Um, what's the update? Do <laughs> Sakuna slash Miguel yet? <laughs> Hey, unrealized thoughts, bro. Hey, welcome to the stream. Hey, you're, you're regular here as well. Welcome to the stream, bro. If you didn't know, Miguel is dodging the slashes himself, bro. Miguel is dodging the slashes. I need to show you guys because I know some of you are new here and you haven't seen the the real, real, real spoilers. Look. Miguel is dodging slashes. Who would have thought Miguel would be able to dodge some slashes, bro? Nobody. I I, I mean, I didn't know. Man said, <laughs> you can see it, Miguel. You can see my curse technique. <laughs> Yo, my hair movie, you can see my curse technique. Nah, people seeing the dismantle is crazy, though. Bros was, uh, you know, on Giga last week for such TV. Hey, man. Let's see, let's see, let's see how it cooks, isn't it? From now. Yeah, he saw the Twitter comments and was like, nah, man, these guys are disrespecting my name. I know Gojo quit me, but no way that this much disrespect is happening, bro. No way. No way this much disrespect is happening. Like you guys, you guys are gonna, <laughs> you guys are gonna say sorry after this. After this, you guys are gonna say sorry for sure. Uh, will you take a break next week? Uh, what do you mean, TTT? Um, but I will. Will I take a break next week? What do you mean? I'm a bit confused. If they knew Gojo would lose, then wouldn't they have a plan to save him if he did? The the problem is it's a bit hard to it's a bit hard to save somebody that um that wants to give it their all and they don't want to fight with others. You know, cause Gojo warned them that don't come in unless I'm like severely injured or like, you know, something bad happening, but how can you save him, you know, when he had when everyone thought he won? You know what I'm saying? It didn't look like Sukuna was winning, it looked like Gojo was winning and then he got sliced. So it was a bit hard to like predict. Um, Yuta and Lori tries to to convince Miguel by telling him that it's better to fight Sukuna rather than a giant cursed spirit merger, which could just stump a whole country like God's. What? The merger could stump the whole country? What the hell? Yo, I didn't think the merger was that. So Sukut Oh my god guys I thought I switched off the stream accident. I was about to get stressed. Nah. <laughs> because my my knee almost hit the anyway, ignore me. Nah, I don't whoa be... I can't believe it. I'm looking at the text. Oh my bad, my bad. I'm looking at the text and they're saying that the <laughs> the merger could stomp out a whole country like Godzilla. What? Yeah, they just had pl plans in case he lost. Yeah, that's it. The, that's the only thing they had. Yo, these spoilers are going insane, though. Like, I'm just finding out. You know, the text is actually very interesting. People say it's boring. Did, did they even, like, people didn't even see what is, like, happening or going on before they start saying that, you know, it's boring. I don't know why people do that all the time. Why be a... Kate, uh, welcome to the stream, man. I appreciate you for coming through. Hey, I'm happy that you felt comfortable to chat in the stream. So, you know, as a new individual, welcome. I hope, I hope you uh, welcome you to the GX family, bro. Or GX Yakuza, which, whichever I end up <laughs> deciding to, to name, you know. Uh, Miguel jumping Sukuna. Hey, W jump. We love the jumping. We love the jumping. What's good, fam? Yeah, you're definitely from the UK or uh, Canada. One of the two, because I know they say they say fam as well. 
And that means you're up at like 4 a.m. as well? Something like that? Something crazy? Uh, people don't like words, you know that. <laughs> hey, Bushido, you're spitting. People do not like words. Every time they see text, they're like, oh, hell no, this is boring. Bro, let me see if I remember that. There was one time in JJK that people were saying that it was boring now. What was it? I think it might have been the JJK anime where there was no action. Um, either the ghetto version, the ghetto time, or, you know, the last episode when they were showing the aftermath of Shibuya, they said that the episode was boring because there was no fighting. I was like, yeah, I can't lie. A lot of people are lost. There's a lot of people that are lost. Anyway, though, guys, we actually get to see the next batches of panels. Miguel was dodging Sukuna slashes. Yeah, that's what I was explaining. That's what I was explaining. Look. Look at this. This guy is quick. Miguel is flexing in style. Who would have thought? Hey, no, you guys you guys don't understand. Who would have thought Miguel would have been cooking like this? Like, even Sakuna smiling like, damn. Hey, yo, you, 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 you kind of you cool. Nah, man. Hold on. Oh, my bad. Wow. Miguel is dancing on this guy, bro. Yeah, unfortunately, even though, you know, there's a lot of people that read JJK only through TikTok, bro. What do you expect, you know? If you read JJK only, only through TikTok, you're not going to be able to know nothing, man. You're not going to be able to, <laughs> to find out or figure out anything, bro. Let, let's be real. Let's be honest. This panel is insane. He's Dr. Sukuna, bro. This guy knows how to move, man. Hey. Miguel, Miguel is him. Miguel is him. Miguel is him, bro. Actually, I, hey, I'm not going to lie. Miguel is going to get... Hey, the memes for him is going to be crazy. I don't think you guys understand. The memes for Miguel is going to be insane, like... This guy is doing crip walk. Like, he's actually crip walking on Sukuna, bro. Hey, I can't lie. That, that's a video coming soon, man. I can't lie. Because look, Miguel is... Like, he's flexing too. Like, bro, he's flexing. He's, he's, he's like, you know, moving. He's moving like Mike Tyson right now. Oh, Muhammad Ali. Fly like a bat, like, sing like a bee. Like, bro, nah, I dodge. Like, bro, he's cook. He's cooking. And he's a weakened Sukuna, of course, we know. But look look what happened to Maki. Look what happened to you. Utah. Like, look what happened to all these people, bro. A, a weaker Sukuna don't mean nothing, man. And he tanked the Gojo punches. That's what I'm saying, bro. That's what I'm saying. Miguel is mugging everywhere. I'm assuming you mean dodging. I'm not sure. Uh, what's mugging? I'm not sure what you're saying. But uh, you told Kotsu, uh, could you just explain what mugging is? But I'm assuming you're saying dodging. I think I think you're saying dodging. Okay, so. You think Miguel is stronger than Utah? No, I don't think he's stronger than Utah. But he's definitely... He definitely helped Utah by teaching him, so... Hey, man. Hey, man. Alright, cool, guys. So, now, it seems like... The FX guy is going to skip some pages since Gojova is going to post all of them, apparently. I don't know. He might as well just post all the rules, no? Isn't that just what, what usually happens? Wait, man said... <laughs> man said he's mewing. Don't kill. <laughs> man said Miguel's mewing. Don't make me laugh. Where did you get that from? Don't kill. 
<laughs> nah, I can't lie. What Miguel is doing is hilarious, bro. It is hilarious. It's so funny. Yuta came back as an MVP of the Cullen Games. Bro was not playing around. I said, hey, yo, bro. Um, Wave is missing. I have to say, you understand what I'm saying. What? I said, I got a One Piece laugh. Nah, I... What? Me? Nah, I ain't got no One Piece laugh. I said, Z, ha, 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 ha. Nah, I ain't got, I ain't got none of that. I ain't got none of that. Wait, skip the pages. Yuji's back. What the? Wait, hold on. Yuji kind of looking calm here. Hold on. Oh, I know. I don't know if you guys can see that clearly, but Yuji's doing a sledgehammer, and like he's actually fighting though. Damn. And it looked like Sukuna just barely blocked that even. Yo, the MC's finally back, guys. Hey, he took, you know, maybe a couple chapters off, but he's back now. Hey, when I tell you, Yuji's one of the... He's the least MC of any show I've ever seen in my life. But it's, it's entertaining, though. It's entertaining, like, you know, everyone else's dynamic is interesting, you know? But flipping hell, man, this guy's barely a main character. <laughs> this guy sometimes is barely the main character, bro. It's actually hilarious. Like, he's not the strongest. He's not the most special. Like, really and truly, what is Yuji that's different from everyone else? I don't know, man. Uh, JJK Maya is the fastest, in my opinion. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, Maya um, is giving panels, is allowing F9 to post panels, I believe. Or they're just working together and F9 is skipping some chapters so that, you know... Uh, I don't know if maybe something happened to Miguel, which is why that's that happened. But you can see Miguel is still in the fight. He's not completely gone. And then when, you know, Yuji came in the cut, then now it looked like there's going to be some raw moments happening. Yuji in six, bro. Yuji is definitely in six. Yuji is in six. Bro, I want game seven Yuji to Dory. Where you go, I go. Like, that's what I'm looking for. That is what I'm looking for, bro. Um, Hold on. At this point, everyone needs to jump. Yeah, bro, just get everyone to jump. Facts. Just get everyone in. Um, The honor one, I know what do you mean I'm like you. I was waiting him to open live stream, but he didn't. Uh, oh, okay, I, I get I get what you men are saying now. I get what you men are saying. Okay, so another panel incoming. Hold on, let's see let's see what else is in the in the works, man. You you just Itadori is already going crazy. Let's see who else is going crazy. Maki joining the fight as well. Nah. Wait, I want to know how she survived the black flag. <laughs> Wait, she she's smiling. Bro. Is, does Maki have RCT or not, bro? And when I say reverse curse technique, I know she doesn't actually have curse energy to do reverse curse technique. But I want to know how quick her healing property works. She just got hit with a black flash. And she's still here. You and me, Mimi Kona, go. Okay, hold on. Now, now it's getting a bit confusing. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So Maki joined the fight. Yuji joins the fight. He's skipping the pages. Okay. Alright, so Maki joined the fight, Yuji joined the fight. We see that um, we have a translation of what Loru was saying to Miguel. And they should fight together. Just to give peace to Ghetto. So, you and me, Mimiko, Nanako, Manami, uh, Tohish, some, some, you know what I'm saying, side characters. Everyone simply loved, you know, Shugi chan which is, you know, Ghetto. Uh, Shibuya, you're telling me I should avenge him? Or do you want me to get back... Ghetto's body from Jack and Jackie. No, I'm just saying we should both mourn for him. Just like visiting his grave, eating together, and waving goodbye to him, let's fight with everything we have and tell him to take care in heaven. 
I mean, hey, man. That means Ghetto, you know what I'm saying? He really looked after these people. He took care of them. Like, they're their own. Like, he, that's his own, you know? Because it seems like they all see him like a, a father figure. Which is actually kind of kind of interesting. And it's very common. Loru, we fight with everything we have and tell Ghetto to take care in heaven. First of all, he definitely went to hell. <laughs> Yo! Yo, that's hilarious. Hold on, I know you guys can't see that. Oh, you probably can't see it at all, innit? Yeah. Hold on, let me uh see if I can do this. Oh, did that show? Did that show now? Maybe, maybe not. Uh, maybe not. But basically, long story short, um, when they were having a discussion, they were like, "Yeah, Ghetto definitely went hell, bro. He didn't go heaven at all. <laughs> no way he did." Hey, Miguel, Miguel is just keeping it hundred, though. Guys, you can't blame Miguel for keeping it hundred percent. He just said, "Yo, the what?" Sukuna tops the unknown guy and gut punches him. He throws blood, Sukuna with a cold stare. Cold stare? This guy is smiling, bro. Did he hit? He just hit Loru with a black flash. No way he hit Loru with a black flash. Ah, uh, yeah, guys. This ain't gonna end up too good. I'm not gonna lie to you. Yeah, this is... This is not good. I think I don't know if that's the last the last page, but oh, it is the last page. Yeah, Sakuna just destroyed L L Laru. Oh my gosh! Ah, oh, that is not that is not nice. He literally did the second black flash. That was nasty. Yeah, Laru is cooked. Now you hear me. <laughs> Straight face black flash. He is getting pissed. Yo, Sukuna's fighting everybody, bro. He's trying to get everyone up out, out of here one by one. Where's the Fuga fam? Bro, how Gege is the most weirdest Raya ever. Why is Fuga not here yet? There's so much stuff that's not even here yet. Anyway, let me read what the chat is saying, man. Only narrative of the bad guys go to heaven. Facts. Madara's go to heaven. How? It, and it has to go in heaven as well. It actually killed the whole clan. I don't care what the reason is. Uh, she can she can heal. Uh, she healed from the damage Naira did to within a minute. Yeah, a few minutes and seconds in a fight is all the difference. So that's why I'm surprised. I want to know if the, after the time skip, she might be able to heal faster than you know a couple minutes. Because if you could do it in a few seconds, like you know, Kenjaku can get Gojo can. Um, Sukuna can Then that is useful In a fight But One on one She doesn't seem like She can heal fast uh, Break with Next week or now nah? I'm not sure <laughs> I'm realised Force is like Welp Yep yeah, That's typical Not surprised Alright guys So I know a lot of you Are here and wondering Okay this is the last page So there's nothing more to give Just to let you know My Mura is posting it as well Okay, it's posting the leaks, and the leaks that they're posting, this person forgot some of the pages. They left some of the pages out, so we get to see how everything unfolded. So there's still more, guys, there's still more to see. And if you're new here, and you haven't already, leave a like on the stream. It's always appreciated when you guys leave a like on the stream. Subscribe if you're new again. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate you if you subscribe. Just, you know, so we can reach the milestones that we would love to reach in the future. And yeah, man, uh, just leave a like. As I said, that's the only thing I asked for. So, um, check with Joey Kimura. Uh, they have more panels there. What's the chapter about? And no black box? Yeah, no black box. Uh, JJK Maya? No, no, I know the panels, but... Yeah, I don't want to do the skip panels. I don't want to do the skip panels. The poster is the skipper one. Yo, how did Larry get done dirty? Second black flash, man. 
How did Larry actually get done dirty, bro? Like this. This is insane. Let me actually um show you guys the next part of it. Because obviously there was uh, more talk. Miguel says he has a condition. He will fight Sukuna after Gojo and you totally loses. And when Sukuna can't use domain anymore. He also wants Leru to join him to fight Sukuna. Because it's better if he has more friends. So he said, hey, if all these conditions are met, I, I, I'll be there. I'll back it. Because that's the only way I'll be able to, you know, keep up. But at the same time, guys, let's actually be honest. Sakuna's going to get his domain soon, isn't he? Like, let's actually keep it 100. Dude. Wait, for, you know what? Forget it. Where is Hakri Kinji, bro? Like, bro, Keke, like, oh my god, I want to see the fight, man. I want to see the fight between Yurume and Hakri as well. Office Glycon. Yeah, 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 yeah. There's new, the new scans. Yeah, yeah, the new scans. We saw the black flash from Sukuna, bro. He did it again. Sukuna did the black flash. I told you, Hakari is cooked. No, he's not cooked. He is not cooked. We don't know what's happening. That's all we're trying to figure out, bro. Maybe before the merger, Choso panel out. Oh, okay. Let's see. And you know what? When Miguel is fighting, you know, it, it, I'm actually surprised he could keep up. I actually think it's very impressive that Miguel could keep up. Like, this guy is literally the, the true honored one. Oh, I'm going to see Ice the next chapter and I already know Hakari lost. Bro, we've seen Ice like multiple chapters. That don't mean nothing. People still waiting on Nobara. Hey, on real life sports, Nobara. Nobara ain't coming, bro. That's a GG's. That is a GG Nori. That is a GG Nori, my friend. There will not be any Nobara. There'll be none. Um, let me see what you guys are saying. Miguel came in, did his job, and dipped. What do you mean he dipped? I mean, he's still fighting, no? I don't think he dipped. People still waiting on a bar. Uh, someone said Choso. I didn't, I didn't even see Choso going, like, I didn't even see Choso. Was Choso fighting? I mean, they skipped some panels, so we don't get to see everything, right? And I'm waiting for my mirror to pose all of them. He's taking so long. They're taking so long. Like they take you so long, just post the like you've done the translations. So now I just want to see the other translations, please. Thank you. Thank you very much, Mimera. So back to the present. Miguel and Loru notices that Sukuna can't use domain. His RCT has been weakened and his heart is inhaled. So now he's smiling. <laughs> Miguel is smiling, like, yep, okay. Now we can fight. Now we can fight. This is the perfect conditions. Um, I like Maki a bit more anyway. I see. Hugo knockout. Uh, imagine during a fight, then all of a sudden, we hear a clap sound. Yo, bro, if we hear a clap sound, I can't lie, you guys will hear me get gas and stream because that's my guy, bro. That is my guy. That is my guy, bro.
Um, let me see what you guys are saying. Uh, back to back black flashes, my king Kaizen. You are <laughs> you're devious. I'll give you that. I just said my my king, bro. Gojo could never. You know what? I'm actually gonna bring up something right now that you guys might start. You know, hey, yo, it was good. It hey, was good supers, bro. Um, I'm I'm gonna bring something that's gonna be controversial. And I think my friend pointed out to me as well. We might have to have a discussion. Let me see if I can find the panel. Let me see if I can find the panel. Let me see if I can find the panel real quick. Hold on. Because I'm not going to lie to you guys. We might have to have a discussion right now. We might have to. We might have to. I retweeted it so then I can look at it here. Look, Miguel speed blitzes Sukuna and punches him in the stomach or in the heart where he, look, he, he speed punches Sukuna and punches him in the heart. Look, even Sukuna's like, what the hell? He just speed blitz me. Now, look, before you guys get onto me, listen very carefully. Gojo was able to smoke him hand-to-hand -hand combat. And Sukuna just got blitz. Now you could say, wow, Sukuna was weakened. This is a Sukuna post Black Flash, meaning that he's 120% of his potential, plus he has the momentum of the Black Flash. And he got speed blitz by Miguel. That is kind of crazy. But Gojo, hand to hand combat, was smoking him. Miguel is going to be top 10, 100%. Miguel is going to be a top 10. He's a top 10 candidate. Miguel is definitely a top 10 candidate. But does that mean that Gojo is better than Sukuna hand-to-hand -hand combat? Does that mean Gojo is better in hand-to-hand -hand combat then? It's in his genes. Yeah, that's facts. No, you, 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 that's facts. That, that's true. Hey, hey, you, you already know you got that superpower. Gojo got the best hand-to-hand. -hand. Yeah, so it confirms. And if people try to argue with you, Sukuna might ha might lose. He could... Okay, you want me to repeat, Nicholas King? Okay. Miguel has just speed blitz Sukuna. This is a panel of Miguel speed blitzing Sukuna because even in the translations up here, it says... Well, I know you can't see it. It says Miguel blitzes and shocks Sukuna with his punches. When Gojo, if you guys remember, when Gojo went against Miguel in Volume Zero, bruv, what did what did Miguel do? Miguel couldn't speed blitz him or nothing. Remember, Miguel was trying to get away as fast as possible. He wasn't able to get away, and Gojo was just too fast for him. So when Gojo was fighting, Gojo <laughs> Gojo was able to land hits on him, and you know Miguel couldn't do nothing back. He was overwhelmed. So by that metric. Hand-to-hand -hand combat wise, I will have to give it to Gojo over Sukuna. And you could say Sukuna is weakened, so you can't really count that and stuff like that, which is true. But this is a new form Sukuna who at the end of the day you don't need your domain expansion to do something. The curse energy, the curse energy is, you know what I'm saying? Still the curse energy is low, but he has black flash, which means he restored some of the curse energy. So he's stronger than when he was inside the domain against Utah. Yeah, Gojo had uh, been had better hand to hand. Uh, Gojo straight was Sukuna. Yeah, because a lot of people were saying now that Sukuna has four arms, right? They were saying four arms Sukuna will be able to beat Gojo in hand to hand. But I don't think that's I don't think that's true, man. I'll be real. I don't think four arms will win. Yeah, hand to hand, hey, Gojo was whooping his ass. He was whooping him. Lori uses his curse and need to grab hold of Sukuna and slams him into the wall. Okay, okay, okay. I think you guys have seen that panel, but I'll show you guys again. The Lori has the hand curse energy thing to be able to shoot things, uh, to shoot it out. Okay. Not feeling like, uh, hey, bro, hey, when I tell you what, 
Go, what Gojo was doing to Sukuna hand to hand was embarrassing. But the thing is, when you have the limitless blue, where you could like suck people into your arms and I mean into your hand with the punches and you know stuff like that, it's actually <laughs> it's actually crazy. So then in the next part, we see actually. Let me see if this. Uh, hold on. Oh, hold on. Yeah. Let me see if uh, this this will help as well. Give me a second. Yeah. Okay. So, if you see, if you see here, you can see that Miguel, okay, is dodging the slashes, and he even jumps in between them. Like, does that mean he's super fast? What is his curse technique? Is it to evade? Is it speed? I don't even know what his curse technique is. I don't even know what he's about. Oh, I know he's just a baller. He's just toying. He's toying with him, bro. Toying. Miguel is toying with them, bro. Heavily restriction. But he has cursed energy, so what kind of heavily restriction would that be? Actually. Yeah, and, and Gojo wouldn't send Yuto Kotsu to Miguel if he has zero cursed energy, because how would he learn cursed energy that way, you know? And he uses the black rope. Now I'm curious who taught Gojo them hands. I mean, hey man, he was a prodigy. I don't think anyone needed to teach him, especially Gojo. You know what I'm saying? Especially Gojo. Not finna lie, uh, Gojo was beating on Sukuna when it came down. Uh, people need to wake up. Yuta wouldn't have begging Miguel to scrap if he was bum. Miguel's strong as fuck. Hey, Miguel's top 10, bro. There's an argument for Miguel being top 10. A strong, strong argument. Come on, how can Choso panel still not be out there? Yeah, Choso Camo, hey, we ain't seen no panel yet, man. Uh, Gojo could we, probably in the next chapter. We'll see in the, uh, if if we don't see in the next few, we'll see it later. Maybe it's different for African sorcerers. Nah, but I think they said there's a very few out overseas sorcerers, so he's like one of the few. The monkey finally getting his time to shine. Uh, hold on, hold on. Hold on, 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 hold on. Who you calling a monkey? Hold on, hold on. Who you calling a monkey? Hold on. Hold on. Yo, that is wild. Hey, brother. Brother, brother, brother. Who you calling a... Who did you... Who did you just call a monkey? Did you call me a girl a monkey? Am I standing on it as well? Hey, hey, hey that, that, that's got to be motivated by something, bro. What did Miguel do to you, fam? Miguel going insane? Yeah, Miguel dodges slashes, man. That is a person that's going insane. We might have to ban this guy. Hey, no, 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 no. Don't ban him. Don't ban him. Don't ban him. Don't ban him. He's black as well, but... I know he said earlier on that he's black, so I'll give it to him in it. But <laughs> hey, saying the monkey, <laughs> saying the monkey's time to shine is insane, buddy. No, but I can't lie. I see, I see, I see. You know, boo, man. Fair enough, fair enough, fair enough. <laughs> monkey's crazy. <laughs> Yo, imagine getting hit by red imbued the hands. Yeah, that's the problem, man. Yeah, get this man out of here, lol. Uh, he's ghetto skull. We might have to ban this guy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Friendly fire, bruh. Yeah, that's a friendly fire of death. I was on, I thought we were on the same team. Who let me go out of his kit? Okay. Okay, I thought, okay, what's going on? Hey, what's going on with all this, like, you know what I'm saying? Monkey referee. Oh, okay, okay, okay. You know, it was funny. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But now, let's... Let, let, let's chill. Let's chill, guys. Man. Let's chill, bro. Oh, yeah, let's let's chill, bro. Let's chill. 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 All right. And the narrator explains the curse technique. Heart catch can grab the subject 
the imaginary hand will restore itself even if it's destroyed but one out of ten of the damage will be directed back to Larue. Oh, one tenth of the damage will be directed back to Larue. Interesting. The yeah, imaginary hand will restore itself one ten. Okay. Um, I'm assuming every time that hand is hurt or damaged, then Larue will only feel one tenth of it. Which at the end of the day, even though. Yeah, that's still bad it's still bad but the fact it can restore itself i guess that's why but larry is going to be feeling one tenth of all these attacks and stuff damn my apologies nah it's all right 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 but like you know what i'm saying you know what i'm saying touch it touch it <laughs> you, you 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 know what i'm saying though even without me saying without me saying you know what i'm saying you know what i'm saying uh sakuna goons in the comments facts he alone is the honor black now nah, i would win okay <laughs> what the, what <laughs> yo this chat is wild what is, what is the honor, what's the honor black what, what is the honor black please i'm glad he didn't reveal future this chapter oh uh, why did you say that when JK is done, are you going to do other series on your channel? Hey, Nicholas King, I'm trying to do a solo leveling for this weekend. This weekend, I'm trying to get a solo leveling video out. Like, I'm not just trying to do JJK only, you know? I'm trying to, like, go into Kamui, Ninja Kamui, and stuff like that. I said, let me chill. Yeah, yeah, super, you're cool, you're cool, you're good, you're good, you're good. You're good. Um, Nicholas King, bro. I'm telling you, I'm trying to bring, I'm trying to bring a lot, and Chainsaw Man as well, Chainsaw Man's going to be back as well, so, and Chainsaw Man, hey, that used to be in my bag, so, you know what I'm saying, uh, we could get back into the Chainsaw Man groove as well, I think one of my highest viewed videos is Chainsaw Man as well, so yeah, we could do Chainsaw Man, JJK, and we're trying to get into the entertaining, you know, side of YouTube as well, so, we'll get, we'll get there in the end, right now, I'm going to just do this right now, so the level of me going crazy, hey, facts, so the eleven are going crazy. Uh, Cause Kabe Loki summoned Wigel. I mean, he did. I mean, look. I mean, uh, I don't know if he summoned, but I know what you're trying to say. But do you know how funny it is that Miguel speed blitzed him, bro? Do you know how funny that is? Futa, uh, Giga Technique racially motivated. Cage, uh, he's lucky. Sukuna didn't whip this up. Uh, yeah, buddy. That is that is insane. And you call it a futa. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Let me let me let me keep it a thousand with you. Hey, let's let's stop with the rage jokes and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? Let's stop with the rage jokes. Hey, if you do it one more time, you're gonna have to catch a, a timeout, bruh. You have to you have to relax. You have to relax. Because <laughs> You know what I'm saying? It will give license to other people to, you know, wild out even if they're not, you know what I'm saying? So I wouldn't wanna I wouldn't want everyone to have that. I wouldn't want everyone to start wilding like that. So you might have to you might have to catch a timeout if you know carry on type shit. So But I'm just giving you this warning innit, in advance. Cause I don't like doing that to people and stuff like that, so I'm just giving you the warning in advance, bro. But um, let's see, let's see, let's see what else we got, man. It seems I'm, I'm trying to wait for the next uh panel. I've been waiting for the next panel, but I ain't, I ain't catch it. I ain't catch it. I ain't catch it yet. Is your only warning, homie? Yeah, everyone, 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 everyone knows what I'm saying, bro. Everyone knows what I'm saying. Um, so besides that, what is you guys' opinions on Dolores, Dolores curse technique heart catch? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fugs, he he hand <laughs> another black flash is crazy. He landed another one back to back. Moving like Drake. Yeah. 
<laughs> Moving back to back. <laughs> yeah, that's insane. Oh, okay, hold on. We get the curse technique of Miguel. Hold on. Sukuna so thinks Luru's uh, curse technique is no fun, but Miguel's curse technique is highlighting. His curse technique is called Hakuna Lana. Hakuna Lana. Hakuna Lana. Uh -huh. uh, Miguel's curse technique helps his body to catch a rhythm to dodge curses and enhance his physical capability. Wait, wait, what? Wait. What kind of, what kind of, what kind of curse technique is this? His body to catch a rhythm to dodge curses and enhance his physical abilities. Yo, so you're telling me this guy's is cursed energy is giving him music and he's vibing. He's vibing to the music and he could go crazy. Wow. Wait, the screen is still blocked. What do you mean still blocked? Uh, unless maybe I'm tripping. Hold on, let me. Uh, uh, I think I know what you're talking about. I want you guys to see some of the translations and stuff like that as well. Give me a second. Yeah, you guys should be able to see that. So, you, as you can see, he said. Uh, let me just do that here. Sukuna thinks Loris' curse technique is no fun, but Miguel's curse technique is highlighting. Well, highlighting seems like you're basically saying it's interesting. Um, his cousin Nick is Hakuna Lana and it basically makes his body catch a rhythm and then he's able to dodge curses, enhance his physical abilities, stuff like that. Which is insane. I've never seen a sorcerer with anything like that. And that's why he's dancing. I was thinking, what is this way he's moving really fast? But now I get it, the dancing and stuff like that. Hey, shout out to Miguel, man. He's Hakuri 2.0. Hey, bro. You know, the characters that we think, well, that, you know what I'm saying? We don't have the black vibe. They're all dancing. <laughs> I'm actually creasing. <laughs> Yo, that's actually hilarious. All of them are dancing. Bro, fam. I'm not I'm not gonna lie to you. Miguel has shot up as one of my favorite characters in the, in JJK. I know it's only like a few a few chapters and stuff like that. But Miguel has shot up in terms he like shot up my list of my favorites. Like this guy's a vibe. And he's and he's just chilling. Now nah, I can't like black characters in JJK is fire, man. This this the black characters are fire, bro. I can't like Miguel. Hey, he's moving. Miguel's moving me. Yo, am I am I gonna rep Miguel now? Nah, Miguel's moving me. I can't lie. I will not lie to you guys. Miguel is moving me. I might have to get a Miguel pick. I might have to get a Miguel pick, bro. <laughs> okay. That's insane. Okay, guys, that's kind of funny. Man said, what if he can spam Black Flash because he's black? I mean, I'm not going to lie. He's obviously not going to be able to spam Black Flash because he's black. That's 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 ridiculous. But flip it now, man. <laughs> that just caught me off guard. Like, I'm, I'm even reading it now. It's not even funny, but like, that, that, that just caught me off guard. I was like, what? Why would you even say that? That's just... Yo, man, people are ill. Man. Hey, this, this this chat is ill, bro. Short flashback to Gojo explaining Miguel's Kastanik to Utah. Gojo says Miguel's Kastanik brings out buffs and debuffs of himself and the opponent without using a domain. So he's able to debuff Sukuna. Gojo adds that is a pretty useful to curse technique, not really a scary one. Ah, oh, it's not scary, but it's useful? Interesting. Scary means like, yo, like I could die. But useful is helpful because you, you're able to debuff your opponent. So you guys are... So what, right now, what is happening? Um, let's see. I'm part of the Miguel PR team? Bro, I think I'm part of the Miguel PR team as well, man. Hey, I, I'm supporting Miguel. I'm supporting him. I'm supporting. I'm supporting the Miguel. I'm su I'm part of the Miguel clan as well now, man. I'll be real. Miguel better than Hakuri. Dude gritty his way out of them slashes. Fruit. Okay. There always has to be one person that ruins the party. 
Sammy said, uh, uh, fraud Kari. Bro, we don't have to disrespect. We can appreciate two individuals that are gas. Hakari's gas. You know, he dances. You know what I'm saying? He's been popular because of the dances and stuff like that. And then Miguel is gas as well because this guy can dance and now he's about to be popular himself. Miguel is him. And uh, Hakari is him. Both of them are him. But Miguel, I can't lie, is cooking. Miguel's cooking right now. Because now the fact that Gorgeous said it's not scary makes me think, okay, maybe he might not be top 10. But he, he, he he's very good for being able to debuff the opponents and buff himself. Yeah, exactly. That's a Jojo vibe. Facts. That's a Jojo character vibe. More like a support character who is also offensively capable. Yeah, yeah, exactly. A support character that can also defend themselves as well. That's literally how I see it. I'm just waiting for the big chapters, man. I'm waiting for the... No, not big chapters. The big uh, panels. Damn. This is the longest, like... Free, like around 3 a.m. is when they started, and they're saying it's 5 a.m. now. No, it's not 3 a.m. It started it's like one hour and 40 minutes ago, it's almost two hours, and they haven't finished the leaks yet. Bro, am I just tripping, or is this like very, very long leaks? Hey, 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 Game Essential Miguel stocks up, bro. Miguel stocks are through the moon, bro, more than Dogecoin. <laughs> Dogecoin, I think, is, is it fell off now. But, hey, in terms of Miguel, through the moon, bro. I'm telling you right now, you are about to see the memes of death with Miguel. You're about to see TikToks of Miguel every day. I'm telling you guys right now, you got, if you use TikTok, you're going to see Miguel. If you don't use TikTok, you're going to see a video from me talking about Miguel. <laughs> I have to talk about Miguel. It's too cold. Yeah, when they were leaking, hey, when they were beefing, it was quick. No waste of time. OP scans, posted all of it, done. Quick, translated as well. But now, yeah, it's a monopoly. Gojo says Miguel's physical capabilities are truly frightening. 99% of Jujutsu sorcerers are Japanese and they use cursed energy to strengthen themselves. Oh, he's... His cursed energy, his cursed technique is not scary, but his physical capabilities are. His, not capabilities, his physical abilities are truly frightening. 99% of Jujutsu sorcerers are Japanese and they use cursed energy to strengthen themselves. Gojo further adds, Miguel, who is a rare skeletal structure and muscles become a threat compared to... Whoa! The stocks is up! Yo! Miguel's stocks are crazy! Nah, What? He's saying because he's black. <laughs> Gojo just said because Miguel is black, he's got the he's got the rare skeletal structure, the muscles, and becoming a threat because you got uh, you got a bounce of core, getting back in beef beefing state. Uh, what do you what do you, you mean, yeah? We gotta go back to the days where the, yeah yeah yeah. I, I know what you're trying to say. If, if I was able to get them back in beef estate, bro, hey, we, we would have been done an hour ago. <laughs> but, bro, bro, I'm telling you right now, when it comes to Miguel, they basically say, you know how um, in general, guys, even in life right now, uh, black people are more tending to be, you know, strong. They're also, tend, like, if, for example, in the NBA, you know what I'm saying? There's obviously people that are different races that are also competitive and have the you know the necessary muscle to have certain jump heights to shoot certain none forget shooting but basically the athleticism and we're just built different when it comes to that so when he now this is basically blatantly saying japanese people are not as you know built as you know people outside of that so the physical capabilities that miguel has is highlighted here blatantly is highlighted here blatantly and obviously i don't know when it comes to toji and maki and stuff like that but all i know is that he has cursed energy 
and he's strong physically. So if he's able to have Toji level of strength while also having the cursed energy, cursed energy and cursed techniques, I can't lie, he's 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 disgustingly broken. But that's why I was saying to you guys before, Gojo was able to still piece him up, but he, you know he wasn't injured, and the reason he wasn't injured was because he's generally that strong. Do you know what I'm saying? Because he was generally that strong, he didn't get injured. It's like punching Toji. Punching Toji ain't gonna do nothing, but if you're using you know your curse techniques and stuff like that, then you could do it. But if you remember, Gojo only had the black. He was stopped by the black rope, so he was chilling. Miguel was chilling. So yeah, man, I'm not gonna lie. I'm impressed with Miguel. Very, very impressed. Jump Kaizen 2.0 start again. Yeah, I hear that. Yeah, Jump Kaizen started again. Nicholas King. Shout out to you for coming through to the stream, man. I appreciate you a lot. Trust me. Uh, I got you a lot, man. Hey, I see you next stream, man. GG. GG, my brother. Uh, Sammy says, okay, JK, Hakari and Miguel are both him, but I got Miguel all the way. He's cooking right now. Hakari needs to stop raising up ice chicken jump. Mr. Kuna. Uh, they really Muhammad and Mayweather. I can't lie. That's one thing I will. Uh, that's that's what I will agree. They, we need to see more Hakari stuff, man. I don't know what's going on. Hakari is not like I don't know why they're not showing us. By the way, sorry for the black screen. I don't know what's going on. What's going on? Wait, talk about what's going on. Let me end this real quick. Hold on, my bad. Let me end this. I was playing the game before, guys. That's like the, to the build up, so I just had to take it away for now. No, let me ex um, yeah. Alright, bet, 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 bet. It's loading now. Cool. So, let's go on it now. Cover of the WSJ. Is that a new anime? I don't know what that is. Anyway, guys. So, looking at it here. Um, Miguel refutes Gojo's statement saying Gojo is labeling him as that because he's black. And that's just discrimination. <laughs> There are black people who are non-athletic. I'm creasing. I'm not special because I'm black. It's because I'm me. Sorry. It's fine. Hey. Hold on. Maybe. Maybe. Me. <laughs> Yo. Me. <laughs> Yo. Maybe. Maybe I'm the one that's wrong. But you know what? You know what I see? What I actually like about this is that they're genuinely acknowledging the, the stereotypes that Japanese people have. Now, if you are a person in Japan and you've never seen a black person before, Gege is basically letting you know black people can still be weak as well. They don't all have to be strong. And it's genuinely because he's him. That's why he's able to, you know, um, be as athletic as he is. So... This is a very interesting dialogue and I never thought JJK would have something like this. It's, it's, it's very, like a lot of people that read the manga, that Japanese are going to be like, oh, you know what? I thought every black person was strong or something like that, you know? They wouldn't know. Obviously now with internet stuff like that, they might do, but back in the day, that, that was not a thing, man. Yo, can you do a quick recap on what's happened? I just joined and I can't find him anywhere else. Um, Snap. So, long story short, just to let you know. Um, no, Gojo's not racist. He's just ignorant. But the only reason he's ignorant is because he's never met people like him before. You know what I'm saying? So, there's only so much you can know. He's not racist. I, that's, that's a bit too far. But anyway, as I was saying, um, a quick recap. Miguel came to the battle... Uh, his, the friend Loru came to the battle. They're the ones that were under Ghetto. Ghetto, long story short, um, well, they're basically fighting for Ghetto in a way, quote unquote. Miguel is dodging dismantles from Sukuna. So Sukuna is just like, yo, this nigga is actually dodging all the dismantles. What's going on here? And in the process, Miguel is fighting Sukuna hand to hand and speed blitzes Sukuna because. He got a special curse technique 
that allows him to dodge curses and enhance his physical abilities, even though he's already strong as well. So, he's basically like a freak of nature. So, yeah, that is the quick recap. Uh, this is one of the funniest chapters of JJK. Bro, they actually made H M Miguel hilarious, bro. I can't lie. Miguel might be my guy, bro. Ah, oh, Miguel might be my guy, bro. <laughs> like, he's actually a funny guy. Like, this is, this is my type of character. Yeah, I mean, not that he has no... Yo, thank you so much, new sub. Hey, yo, no problem, Snap, man. I appreciate you for subbing. And anyone else that's here that's new, I would appreciate if you could leave a sub... If you can also... Yeah, so if you could leave a subscribe on the channel, you know, it'd be much appreciated. You know, when I do the streams, I always want to do them every week. And it helps motivate me to do them every week and stuff like that as well. So I would really appreciate it. And also, if you could leave a like on the stream, just to let, know pe let people know that, yo, this stream exists and you can get some spoilers at as well. Okay. So everyone can dodge the world cut slash except Gojo. Um, yeah, let's not act like Gojo was like able to react to it. It was able not to react to it and there was no conclusion. So for example, if you realize, if you're headed to the end of the finish line, right? You're always going to naturally have a... Like, let's say you did a long marathon. You're obviously going to naturally slow down towards the finish line. And imagine someone just passes you quickly. Obviously, you thought you won. So, you know, saying you chilled. And you didn't expect someone to pass you in the finish line when you were doing, you know, your long marathon. So, those are different conditions as to why. But if I know someone is coming under behind me, I'm going to run all the way. So, that's why I don't like the comparison where Gojo's not able to react to it and stuff like that because Gojo thought he won and like he was he was gassed he was done but if Gojo knew he didn't win he would have dodged it or he would have been prepared and also bearing in mind Gojo didn't think that the dismantle could cut through him through Sukuna because Sukuna was blatantly saying that I can't go through um I can't go through the infinity, I can't go through the infinity, and it didn't he couldn't go through the infinity the whole time. How are you meant to know Maharago is gonna give you that ability? You know? So back to the fight, Miguel grabs hold of Sukuna's arms and lands a heavy punch. Immediately Sukuna's back is hit with Choso Supernova. Finally, Choso did something. Yo, I ain't seen Choso do nothing in a minute. So shout, shout out to Choso, bro. But, yeah, man, this is what I was talking about. Miguel, <laughs> Miguel being physically strong is so surprising because even Sukuna's like, what? How the hell am I getting physically overwhelmed? Nah, Adwin, nah, Miguel is the true Adwin. Look, look at this. <laughs> look at this, guys. This is the true nah Adwin, bro. This is the true nah Adwin. Is Gojo back? No, he's not back. But the black just a wild. Yeah, the black just from before were wild, wild. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Is this legit? No, of course not legit, but it's kind of funny, isn't it? Like, it was a meme that someone made. But this one's legit, of course, if that's what you're asking. Yeah, yes, it, it, I know your eyes might not believe it, but Miguel actually successfully got Sukuna on the ropes and dodged and, you know what I'm saying, punched him as well. Yeah, Choso Camo, I know you're waiting for that. I know you I know you're waiting for that. I didn't even know you were still here yet. I knew, I knew you were waiting for that, man. Look at this. The fact that Miguel can overpower Sukuna, do you know how I don't think you guys can even comprehend how crazy that is. Bro, I think Miguel might be top ten. Miguel might be top ten, man. I'm being real with you guys, bro. Miguel might be top ten. It's not Chosova. Yeah, not yet. <laughs> I'll let you know that for free. Not yet. It's not Chosova yet, bro. But, hey, Miguel, is he's going to be up there with my favourite characters. I can't lie, man. Miguel's cold. Miguel is cold. Yo, who do you think is dealing the final blow to Sukuna? I mean, it has to be Yuji, right? Like, if it's not Yuji, 
that is not that is not a main character of Jujutsu Kaisen. I'm just keeping it real. Or or, or Megumi. Megumi can have it as well. I allow Megumi to have it. Megumi or Yuji. Because if if Yuji doesn't have the final blow, it's like when are you the main character? Fam, he didn't even have the final blow for Mahito. So when will he get the final blow? For anything. A manga ending where the guy doesn't get a final blow is insane. Crazy that Miguel locked in uh since almost everyone almost died. Yeah, Miguel's locked in, bro. Uh, Boogie Woogie basically Nah not, not like Boogie Woogie Because This is about Him dancing And a rhythm So it's not like Boogie Woogie No But Boogie Woogie Is like changing positions Based on curse energy They're, they're, they're still Quite a bit different Um, Who's your favourite Character personally I like Yuto Choso But I ain't gonna lie Right now Favourite character Was Hakari But hey Miguel's getting up there man I'm not gonna lie let me let me let him see let me let him cook. Let me let him cook for the next chapter and then I'll let you guys know if Miguel is one of my favorites, bro, because he's moving me. Today Miguel is moving me. Like just being he's just cold. He's just cold, bro. But oh not the clapping, but like dancing. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I get you saying, yeah. They're just Um Oh Hakari is a good one. But when, yeah, bro, I, I hope he does something soon, man. I hope, I hope Hakari does something soon, bro. Hey, get, get cooking. No, I'm going to be real with you guys. And, you know, I'll always keep it 100% with you guys. The last Yuta and Yuji in the domain is gas. Kashimo, I mean, Kashimo is kind of ass. But if, if we really look at it objectively, this is... Gege's best chapter in like the last 10 chapters he's done. For me, it had a bit of the backstory. The character didn't need to get eliminated. He came in in the clutch. We've got the curse technique revealed. There's comedy. He was able to actually do something that surprised everyone. Everyone thinking that he was going to get cooked. He surprised everyone. The physical capabilities, the mention of Africa, talk about Gojo and you to communicate and about it. The purpose of why they're going to do it. And it's all in harmony because, you know, Ghetto originally was attacking them because he wanted Rika. But now he's helping them because they know Ghetto liked Gojo and would want him to help the next generation. Then we get some talk about the Africa. Like, bro, this chapter might be, is one of my favorite chapters in the last 10. Even though it's not the fighting ones. Like, the, the cycle is broken. As someone said, so the fighting broke. Okay, so as Choso, you know, comes in the clutch and puts the supernova, which I don't know if it had any impact. Yuji then comes in the cut. Alright, you can see Yuji comes into the cut. And, uh, yo, I'm not going to lie. If you really look at the ground, that punch from Yuji was tough. Like, even the train rails got up or the fences. I don't know what those are, but they just went up to the sky, bro. Yeah, I think... Wait, they're fighting in the station. Are they fighting in the... Are they fighting in the station? Where are they fighting? It looked like a train station. Unless I'm tripping. I don't, I don't know. Because look, I'm... Look, like... When Yuji did the punch, like, some rails came off. And stuff. So, it might be. It might be. Finally, the MC's back. Yeah, man. I, I've been saying this. Finally, Yuji's back, bro. Finally. What is Miguel's curse technique? It's plain piece. I came late. Is it water? <laughs> Yo, water manipulation is a funny one, but I could kind of see why you said that. Nah, his um, curse technique is basically allowing him to dance to a rhythm and he can dodge everything. He could dodge the curse techniques that Sukuna throws. So the dismantle. Um... And he basically does like a little dance. Every black, every quote unquote black people in, in the show can dance. Look, he did like a little dance and is able to uh, dodge curses and enhance his cap uh, physical capabilities with his curse technique. So he gets a boost. And he can also buff you. And he, he can buff himself and debuff you. So then you're weaker, which is very good for this fight. Very, very good. And then the narrator says, 
it, the narrator explains that to activate World Slice, Sukuna has to use the hand sign Enmaten, which is also used for Malevolent Shrine. But since Sukuna was left with just one arm of the Gojo's final hollow purple, he used the binding vow to send World Slice to Gojo without hand sign. Flipping hell, man. Like, like the fact that still talking about the Gojo Sukuna fight in terms of how Gojo was defeated and stuff like that is hilarious to me. Man said, like, because what does Gojo, what does the slash without the hand matter here? Unless, you know, Sukuna did something crazy right now. Narrator explains that to activate World Slash, Sukuna has to use the hand sign M now 10, uh, which is also but since Sukuna was left with just one arm after Gojo's final hollow purple. He used Bandavar to send Wall Slash on Gojo without a hand sign. That is crazy. Can Sukuna stop holding back now? Yeah, bro. Um, I don't think Sukuna's holding back right now. But the, he has more stuff in the sleeve. Like, he hasn't used Fuga yet. Like, unless he uses Fuga, he's not going all out yet. That's literally it. Do you to do anything impactful to Sukuna? Because... Is just Yuji carrying by... Lo no, come on, bro. I mean, Yuji did the whole domain expansion. This is why they're even able to interact with Sukuna in the first place. When Su when Yuta came, he did a lot of damage. I'm not going to lie. Let's be honest. Let let's get it right, bro. Okay, okay, okay. So, uh, didn't he just prove that Sukuna's new form is... You stronger than Maguna. I mean, we yeah we know that already. Um, the Maguna form is kind of weak, man, in comparison to this form. I'll be honest. It's literally, I think it's a fact as well. Anyway, uh, what did he? Cause his body right now is the perfect juicy body. That's what they said at the beginning. What did he give in the binding vow to get that effect though? Yeah, that's what I'm wondering. That's what I'm wondering as well. What did he give? Oh, what, what was it? His left arm not having a left arm? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. So, what he gave, because you know how you can use reverse curse technique to heal your limbs? Um, so, Kuna basically gave up his left arm to do it. Like, he could have regenerated it, but he gave it up probably without the hand signs. To do it without the hand signs. And then after that, he got in his other body, so Maguna body was the one that had to give it up and not his actual, actual body, if that makes sense. So when he reincarnated himself, then it was like a fresh start. That's why when he was fighting Kashimo in the beginning, beginning, before Kashimo started wiling at the end, um, Ka like, you can see that Sukuna had a left arm. If you if you go back to that fight, you can see his left arm, he didn't heal it after the Gojo fight. He could have healed it if he wanted to, but he left it. I don't know if any of you guys remember that. At all. Oh, hold on. Me and Gojo today. <laughs> Yo, yeah, that's what I'm saying. They're working together now. So that's why it's taking like two hours for them to get out chapters, bro. I'm telling you, if they didn't, work together then the chapters would have been out quicker but this is like the longest anyway so yuji joins the fray and they explain that and what happened next but after transforming into his og arm or og form sakuna now has to use both hand sign and maten and incantation to activate world slash okay so the gojo one he didn't need to actually use you know, because he didn't actually need to use... Oh, okay, so he sacrificed his left arm, as I said before. But now he needs both of them. He needs the hands and he needs the enema 10. An incantation to activate your son. On top of that, um, Sukuna also needs to set the direction for the slash with his hand. What? So how was he able to do it against Utah? Like, uh, you know what, let me... Let me not get into that because I know I know I'm just gonna be like, what's what's going on, bro? What is this? Because I was gonna say, how did he do it to Utah? Because he didn't look like he did anything, but maybe he 
actually said the words and regenerated his tongue that was cut off that fast, you know? That's the only benefit the Dao I could give, really. Really, really, really. Okay, so wait, hold on. Guys, just to let you know, so... Yuji joined, and then this was the next panel. I want to know what happened. I think there's two more pages. Because Loru got a stray of death. I want to see what happened. Uh, just a high output dismantle. He points at Yuji and does the incantation. I thought he pointed at Yuta. Oh, unless that's what you meant. You meant pointing at... Oh, yeah. Sorry, my bad. I didn't read it well. I didn't read it well. Um, he points out at Yuta and does the incantation. Yeah, you're right. You're right. You're right. Um, he had to use a band of to get rid of gold. Yeah, I mean... How could you have to use the band of to, you know, survive with his left arm? Or you would have lost to Kashimo. So I guess you got to do what you got to do when it comes to the binding vows. Let's talk about how uh, weak Yuta's cleave was. I mean, at the end of the day, if we talk about Yuta using other people's curse techniques, of course, they're not going to be 100% max 99. But, yeah, man. No, it's because he had new rules. When he got his body, he had new rules. It wasn't the same as the Binding Vow. It was new rules. Since it wasn't his body originally, it was Maguna. But now it's in, you know, Sukuna body. And what he did, he still was able to cast out and say the incantations and point to Yuta Kotsu to cut him. I remember that as well. That's what he did. He pointed at Yuta Kotsu and he cut him. I'm trying to see if that's like, does that the last panel or anything like that? Uh, I could go in there actually quickly if you guys want. Let me just go in there quickly. Um, so I can really show you guys what I'm talking about. So. Yeah, here. Look. If you look at the, if you look here, hold on, I know I've got Yuji in the way right now. Yeah, that's my boy. Yuji, my boy. Oh. If you look here, this is the hands of Sukuna they're talking about. The one here. On the right-hand side. This is the hands of Sukuna that you're talking about. Where they have to, he has to point like this. Against Gojo, he didn't need to. But for this, he, he needed to point like this. And then that's why he got slashed. Um. So yeah, that's why that's the answer for this one, and he had to direct that slash as well. Whereas against Gojo, he didn't need to really, really point, or, so Gojo couldn't get ready to dodge anything or see anything at all. Unfortunately, of course. And then we see that Maki comes in the clutch. So Sukuna's left arm gets sliced off as he's confronting Yuji. It was Maki who cuts off Sukuna's arm, and she does it with a crazy smile on her face. So goodness, this is where I see Elder Vision about first one. Damn. Bro. Do you know what is crazy? Because if the arm of Sukuna is cut off, guys, what does that mean? Now, you are probably wondering, what do I mean by that? Maki has used the Soul Liberation Blade to cut the soul of Sukuna. And we know already that it's longer to heal. And it's different. But can Sukuna now heal back his arm? Which already normally is difficult. So now he can do it with the Soul Liberation Blade also on top? I don't think he'll be able to do that. And he wouldn't have time to do it. I don't think you would even have time to do it. Maki came in in the clutch. And she's smiling. She's crazy. Maki is insane now. She lost her she lost the plot. She has lost the plot. She has lost the plot. I think copy technique will be weaker in output than the original one. Yeah. I think so as well, but there's some cases like uh, Euro's one where the sky manipulation is helpful regardless, you know. 
the main slotson if you use Bandival, uh that gave up ten ten shadows to increase the power of the world slash as well. Interesting. It's still mysterious to me how the earth so can attack two purples from Gojo. Well he uh, He was weakened heavily. And that's what I can say. He was weakened heavily. Anything Hakari? Bro, what 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 telling you? I wish. I wish there was something about Hakari, but that guy, bro, they don't give him screen time. I don't know what Gege is doing, bro. Like, Gege is like, oh, my days. He gave Kenjaku and Takaba all the screen time in the world doing stupid stuff. And I, that's fine. You know what I'm saying? Hey, some people like it, some people don't like it. I'm not the greatest fan. But they're not showing me us anything of the Hakari fight. Nothing. At all. I mean, Gege is trying to give everyone their moment. And that's why Yuji and Hakari aren't around. Also, thanks to covering the meets. Uh, showing the panel. Been waiting for Miguel delivered, bro. Yeah, Miguel. Hey, shout out to Miguel, bro. But it's not over yet. We still got, we still got a couple panels left. I think two more, guys. Two more, and then we're done. All right, two more panels, and then we are done. Sheesh, this is a long stream today, boy. I want to know what Shoko and others are up to. And if you are new here, because I'm not gonna lie, this might be one of the most amount of views i had for spoilers and leaks to be fair so if you haven't already make sure you leave a like on the stream i appreciate that uh subscribe if you're new as well and yeah let's see um okay yuji proceeds to engage in the fight okay so now we've got the next panel yuji proceeds to engage in the fight while that sukuna can't complete his hand size because he's left with only two arms ah so Mike is able to get rid of both of them. Okay, left only two arms and he can't use RCT yet either. So they can win the fight now. But, and then this is the part where I can scroll down to a previous page. All right. Because I'm not going to let my mirror is going to take forever. I can already tell. Let's be real. And in the previous page, Sukuna so decides to hit a black flash and every time guys you hit a black flash you get cursed energy you know restored and that's what happened with Gojo every time he did the black flash his cursed energy was getting restored again and he was able to use the reverse curse technique this is the same thing that is applying to Sukuna right now because Loru getting the black flashed where uh, if we're being real that's a stray of death like Loru's like why me <laughs> Lori is like why me but that will be able to buff the um, Sukuna curse technique I mean reverse curse technique and curse energy which is a smart move of course it's a very intelligent and smart move I think uh, wait if Sukuna arm is off can't even make another bind around and everyone nah I think, um, I don't know, actually, you know what, I actually, I actually, uh, don't know. I think that you can only do one binding vow, and that binding vow meant that his other body couldn't do it. I think that was the, that was the condition, if I'm mis not mistaken. Where's the story of JJK revolving around at this point? It's revolving around Sukuna Gauntlet, bro. It's a Sukuna Gauntlet. And shout out to Miguel again, man. Miguel moved me, bro. What a W guy. What a cold, cold, cold guy. My girl is cold. And yeah, man, uh, this is literally um, the spoilers that... I mean, <laughs> we could wait for my mirror to see what the last like page is in terms of what the writing is saying. And then after that, guys, if we're being real, a lot of you are up at times that are ridiculous. Some people it's 12 a.m., 5 a.m., 6 a.m., 7 a.m., 12, like normal time. So what I'm going to do, as soon as the last panel is here, I'm going to show the panel, talk about it, talk about it with you guys, and then 
Bro, I'm a dip, man. It's almost 6 a.m. for me, man. I'm tired. Uh, does Shonen Jump hire African Americans? I don't know. I think because they're in Japan, not really. It's probably not there, but you know what I'm saying? I feel like Sakuna's because the Nick reveal is coming. I mean, hopefully it is because there's a lot of things about Sakuna we still don't know to this day. Okay, as if to pour water on Yuji's hopes, Sakuna instantly hits Ryu with the blow first. Narita says Gojo regained his reverse curse technique output with his second black flash. So the King of Curses now gained the second reverse curse technique output. And that is what I told you guys. When Sukuna uses the reverse curse technique, it is going to be gained from being able to punch Larry with the Black Flash. Because that is similar to what happened with Gojo. Gojo had the similar thing. So I even I even talked about it and confirmed it with you guys before the translations. You would think I'm Japanese. Fuga is coming. But just to let you know, guys, that is the last page. And if I'm not mistaken, there is Jujutsu Kaisen next week. I'm not sure if... I I, I want to wait to make sure that there's Jujutsu Kaisen, but I'm not entirely... Um, 100% on that but it seems like it is because they usually would you know make a big deal that there's no chapter next week um, so he's punching Gojo's corpse um, I don't know about that I don't know about the punching Gojo corpse stuff I was thinking about it but I don't know I don't know. Anyway, uh, hello, kudos, man. It, it, it seems like you're new here as well because I ain't recognize the name, so I hope you're doing well. Welcome to the stream. Um, Can he use domain expansion now? He's on his way to making the domain expansion, bro. On his way. So that's why they need to hurry this up quick because if that, if that domain expansion comes back, it's over. It's over. Right now, the story right now and this is probably the last question I'll be answering of the stream. I appreciate you guys for coming through. As I said, the story right now is in a place where there is a lot of things happening with Sukuna fighting people. People are always saying monster of the week, you know, what the hero of the week is getting booned by him. I don't really think so because it was all a group effort. For example, uh, Higuruma, that was all group effort. And then they tried to clutch it. Yuta's not dead, of course. Um... And yeah, man. So, right now, I think the story is in a place where there's so much potential that can happen. And we know that Sukuna will be able to cook. But I'm scared about the landing. Because now Sukuna is getting really, really strong. But I want, I'm very interested in how it will end. So, for people that are saying JJK fell off and stuff like that. Hey man, take 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 the high road, man. You take the high road, bro. I'll be real. JJK ain't fell off. Every time I reacted to this, I'm gas. Every time. So that can't be a fall off. It can't. You were running out of characters, nah, man. But it's a thing where it's like, get get me so many good characters that you guys just want to see the next big name. I mean, you forgot Mei Mei's even in the battle. She's not in in the battle, but she's part of this. So anyway, man, I'm just being real with you guys. This is JJK, man. JJK is lovely. I can't wait till it's animated. If you saw the way Maharaga and Sukuna was animated, don't even you don't even want to know what's gonna happen with, with a shorter fight, which is Kashimo and um, Sukuna, man. You don't want to see that. You don't want to see something like that. But there's definitely gonna be an honored one. Um, my house is getting renovated and here i am in your stream 11 10 a.m hey call me k welcome to the stream i uh, thank you for coming through to the stream if you know leave a like on the stream and subscribe everyone here leaving a like and subscribe i'll appreciate it i've been you know very tired right now i'm not gonna lie bro it's almost 6 a.m but hold on there's one more thing wow i, I didn't expect it but there's actually one more thing that just came uh, the black light sh shines sinisterly. So yeah, I think there's a chapter next week, guys. Uh, if not, they would have told us by now. 
I appreciate you guys for coming through. If you haven't already, make sure you leave a like. And when I say make sure you leave a like, like you know what I'm saying? Could you leave a quick like, subscribe as well? Because you get to see a lot of Jujutsu Kaisen funny things as well. Uh, Jujutsu Kaisen wise. It, basically everything Jujutsu Kaisen. You know what I'm saying? And yeah, man. Uh, I will try my best to stream again this week. But if I don't end up streaming again this week, I'm going to try and get a video. So one of the two, okay? So I appreciate you guys. I said, you can even follow me on Twitter if you want to so you guys can see like the stuff as well. Um, GXL on Twitter. Here you go. So you can see. And if you look at it, I have a community on uh, Jujutsu Kaisen. Look. But don't talk about it. You can't talk about the leaks there. So let me let me not even do that. But uh, I don't know what the hell that was. But uh, <laughs> yeah. So Miguel Blizzards. Let me uh, undo it. Because you know, I don't want people to see spoilers and stuff like that. But I appreciate you guys for coming through. Make sure you leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. Obviously. And yeah man. I'm a peace out. Uh, peace.